off in the water, I'ma smack the life guard trying to save it. We hit that hoes at all, better duck your wig, get out the way, bitch. Cause I heard I smacked the bitch, but she ain't never heard. I can't even answer that. The gas, yeah. And it's kind of bright and cold at the same time, but today, I told y'all, man, y'all better hit that notification bell because we is doing a comparison against the fan favorite name brand, at least $250 more Glock 43X, you know, the infamous Glock 43X versus that micro dagger, man. You know, that only costs about $299. Then you have to pay like a what thirty dollars in shipping and tax, and then a thirty dollars transfer fee. We're not gonna talk about the taxes you have to pay on that Glock. Yeah. And Glock Forty Three X don't even come with the rail, nor does it come with optic ready slide. So you have to spend extra money to go ahead and get an MOS version, which is crazy. When you can go ahead, and, like I say, what you're about to see, get you a nice micro dagger that comes with the rail and come optic ready for a fraction of the price at least half the price of a glock so without further ado we already got these things over here ready for y'all boys sure y'all boys y'all already know that boy t glizzy he love you know making everything super fancy super that that just to not even use that bill that boy got him a mad well on that bill tlr with the optic follow son I mean, y'all love the hollow suns. Y'all be hating on the off brands. Love them hollow suns though. Versus optic ready, real, plain Zane. But this is an MOS version. So this is not even a regular 43. You had to spend extra money to just to get a basic real and an optic cutout. You dig? So I'm gonna be testing them things. I see which one better. And another thing that I really love. Look at the, the capacity. Who the hell wants to carry around a 10 round semi automatic striker fire pistol? That's kind of disrespectful. You might as well just go ahead and get you a nice little revolver and call it a day. Or spend $70 to $100 for five extra rounds. Dude, that's crazy. That's insane. When you can just go ahead and out the mag, get you a nice double stack. 15 rounder so that's 15 plus one out the box already two hundred dollars less you get what you want everything you want and don't mention got to mention the stippling the details and the stippling around the firearm man like can't beat that this is custom done you're not getting this out the box like you're literally paying money 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 just for something you can pay one and done, you did crazy. But go ahead and get them hands loaded up. This one already loaded up. I'll test it out. I would have been on that still, but I was doing a little maintenance on the range. So we don't want to shoot at nobody, hurt nobody. So they got to shut it down for the time being until they're done. Then maybe if we out here long enough, we'll probably switch over. But I'm out here with my boy Glizzy. So. I gonna help me test that thing out. So, let's get started, you dig? Uh, like I said, we got Micro Dagger versus 43X, you know. Like I said, this is the MOS version decked out. So, this is technically not what you're getting at your standard 43X. But, we still can do a good comparison on that thing, you dig? And sorry if I'm squinting my face hard, but it's bright as hell. That sun is beaming in my junk. I probably look bright as hell, no okay. cap. But yeah, man, right now I got 10 loaded up at this. Like I said, lovely double stack 15 round mag, dig. And you're getting the same grip, same slide um, length as the 43X. But like I said, you're getting a real and optic cutout, man. If you check out my other video, I got the specs on it, so it'll, it'll let you know what, what you know, optics will be compatible with this, you dig. So check that video out. Right now, I'm going ahead and get 10 shots on this top left circle. I already got them wrote, written off, marked off. PSA dagger, Glock 43S. And let's see how we do, man. I 
ain't even gonna waste our boy's time. But I bought him out here for. Gotta find this mag though. I really don't want to put my baby on the ground, but take about a 10 round single stack. Who the hell wants to walk around with that? Like, you damn, they gotta carry three extra mags. Feel me? So, like I said, I'm get this thing. And I got the red dot on it, so it obviously might be a little bit better. See that thing on. But yeah, man, you see how this thing shoot versus the other one, the trigger and everything. Really what we're going for. Jeez. Oh, real. You got a jam on that thing. It might have been because of me. I'm not sure. Because I am holding that thing a little light. I don't know. But so far, pretty decent grouping. I missed one, actually. And this thing feel way more snappier than the micro dagger. I'm not going to lie to you. This thing feel a lot heavier. I don't know if it's because of the light. And the extra accessories but it does feel heavier and a little bit i don't know just more harder to shoot like and i don't like the, the triggers yeah. don't get me wrong we got the standard glock trigger but compared to all the other glock triggers bro the 43x it feels like look what it did no, I'm just playing. <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> but it does feel like it's slicing your finger, bro. Like, this little blade right here with the with that recoil, bro. I'm not going to lie. It feel like it's just <clears throat> kicking your finger, bro. Compared to, you know, the micro dagger. Got a smooth curve trigger. Ain't got, a ha ain't got that extra blade in there. And it feels lighter. You dig? So my personal opinion like y'all already knew what i was gonna say that micro dagger definitely better in my opinion and this is the mos version the trigger is better it feels lighter as far as recoil and i don't know if you can see but i'm getting more more center shots than i am with the glock and i have a red dot on so with the with the glock i'm shooting more to the left and i think that's because i'm trying to i don't know i think i'm trying to run from that from that feeling of the uh, trigger kicking my finger for real for real i'm trying to adjust to that so i don't know if they were load them up and let that boy glizzy test that thing out that boy glizzy see what that boy think you know try him out on the second two circles but yeah man one two three four five six nine and the eight and then three outliers no nines three eights and one two three four five six outliers and one miss that's crazy. Micro dagger, man. Versus this thing. That boy said this thing. <laughs> yeah, another thing I wanted to show y'all boys. This. If you do have a dagger and you just wanted to get an extra clip and an upgrade on your gun. This clip, this double stack 15 rounder is compatible with the Glock 43X. As you can see. No issues. And definitely... We'll run for all this, which I'll probably get a mag dump for y'all boys. So, yeah, man. Yeah, man, I got that micro dagger. Uh, then we got that Glock 43X. We got that about 10 yards away in two circles. PSA dagger on the left, Glock 43 on the right, Glock 43X on the right. And get your thoughts on it, man. This man a pin on it, man. Micro dagger was the Glock 43X, man. See how that thing hit. Yeah. Ain't gonna lie, bro. Alright, we need honest opinion, man. I ain't gonna lie, opinion. bro. The thing that caught me off guard was the dot. You get what I'm saying? I'm not necessarily I'm not used to the three dot. I'm used to the Glock field goal. Yeah. So I suck that a line in my shots. You feel me? I'm be honest. But bro, this thing feel nice though. The snappiness compared to a Glock snappiness. 
is not as like, uh, like, like block snapping this is like, it's snapping back at you. This not, this not as snapping, bro. You feel me? It was easy to get my shot back on site. And then, bro, that trigger, dude, it felt like shooting my regular dagger, bro. I do like, I do love that trigger. I'm talking about light. I love that trigger, bro. But besides getting the, like, I'm not really, once again, I'm not good with the three, the three dots. You feel me? I like it better than the field goal, but I'm not good with it. I don't, I don't really get practice with, with irons that much anyways. I'm be a hundred, bro. I'm a, bro. My oh boy, Mr. Red Dot. Come on, I'll be honest, Mr. bro. Red you dot. feel me? Yeah, I, I gotta be honest. Love some Red Dot. But oh boy, don't have a pistol or a rifle <laughs> without a dot or a scope on it. I'm not gonna lie to you, that. <laughs> oh, you check shit. my collection out. I got a lot of weapons without scopes and, and red dots, man. Every weapon this man got, man. He probably got a red dot on a knife if he could. No cap. But got yeah, you. man. I don't know. I don't know. I, that, that's my steel on. That's what I like. You feel me? Which is my biggest downfall. Because I even told him, bro, I got to start practicing more with iron. But, bro, I like this. I like this. You feel me? Now, I'm be real. I'm scared of that Glock for real. Because like he said, bro, that trigger be slicing your finger. And this one was easy to lay on it. One thing about it is I like to keep my, my trigger finger straight. That Glock kind of it kind of force it to bend a little bit. And yeah, so, that's why I, I like this right here, bro. You feel me? And then number two. I suck at um, shooting with two eyes open. And so I was trying my best to do that, which probably what made all my shots go left or probably just me how I shoot. But hey, this ain't nice, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. What's up, man? Time for that Glock, man. See what that Glock yeah. doing, man. Put that thing in. I should, I should put a napkin on. This is a beauty. I should have put a napkin under him. Like, that was disrespectful. Layer on the ground like that, bro. I'm already doing that thing. Yeah, all right, bro. y'all, boy. Can't stress it out, bro. On top of that right. black book, yeah. I'm red dot. I'm already doing that, boy. You're a point where really. he's shooting red dots all the time. <laughs> Ah, fuck. I found it. This is a long time. Where? Where? What in the. Where? Yeah, that boy just bad, bro. Bro, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest, bro. I just know this shit. I just know this gun too fucking well, bro. I'll be honest. I just, I just, I do wear If you see how my shots went from here, all oh, they started moving over, I know my dot. You get what I'm saying? And so that just comes with my, my fucking experience, bro. You feel me? But realist realistically speaking, that 40, that uh PSA Bico dagger felt 10 times better in my hands. This one, I probably ran through it. And once again, it's because I knew it. I knew where to put my shots at. This one, it took me time to kind of find it, put it back, uh, and get it aligned. Bro, but this wasn't, it wasn't comfortable shooting this. It wasn't comfortable shooting it at all, bro. That thing do look beautiful, though. Yeah, it's, it's nice, but. But I ain't gonna lie. That is a very good showcase of what practicing with your firearm look like. Oh, bro. yeah. Oh, yeah. Get y'all out to the range and train with y'all weapon, no matter what it is. You train with it, you're gonna be on point. No matter the weapon, the weapon ain't gonna make you a good shooter. It's the experience and the training. You get to the range, but this boy be out here working hard. So y'all need to subscribe to his channel. That boy got mad training videos for sure. Hey, we going crazy, man. Dummy, dummy. Hey, we try to change the narrative, y'all boys. They already yeah. hate us. Y'all be hating. But look where we at, bro, at the range. Shooting yeah. at targets. Yeah. We're not hurting nobody. We're not doing nothing wrong to nobody. So what's the real issue, man? Like, y'all always be trying to troll just because how we look, bro. But what are we doing? Nothing. So get off our nuts. And how about y'all get out here and train? We probably trained in half of y'all. Probably 85% of y'all that be in our comments trolling us. So get to the range, train. Like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell because we did come with some more content. Me, don't have that good, 
good fire and gas over there. That boy ain't gonna come with that good tactical, tactical um content you did. But that boy got all the gear for real. That boy geared up. See that boy, Mr. Accessorizer. So yeah, man, I'm gonna go ahead and get Timo loaded up. I'm gonna work on some slow control grouping. See if I can get all in the same dot, in the same circle, same ring. You dig? Let me go ahead and get some shots on. Like I said, trying to see if I can get them all in the X. You dig? Now I got 10 shots. See how well I can group this thing. About 7 to 10 yards away. Ooh, I threw that one. Okay. Definitely threw that one. Brush No luck back. But I threw one. I don't like that. Really two. Boom, boom. Through them things. Hold on. As you can see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten shots, man. And we got only three in the X. We got four in the nine and then two in the eight. Pretty smooth grouping though. About ten yards. Almost the size of my fist. But then throw this last one rushing. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, almost as good as my boy Gleezy's. He did. Now I'm gonna test him out with that red dot. I suck. With red dots, man. I suck with red dots. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know why. I'm the opposite of Glizzy, man. I'm an iron sight, man. The red dots be throwing my brain off. I don't know why. I think it's just too much going on, and I probably just get scrambled. So I'm gonna try with that red dot, that 43 x See how well I can group that thing. See if it's a better grouping. Yeah, man. And let me know y'all thoughts and opinions on it, man. Would y'all like that 43 x Would y'all prefer that dagger, man? last round man and i'm gonna use that psa dagger dagger um magazine just to see if it works show y'all boys it work and i love how that thing sit in flush with that that um magwell but that thing a oh, baby but chamber is perfect let's see if that thing runs properly see if i can get a good you know group like my boy glizzy that thing he did got to figure out that red dot first Almost as good as Gleezy, you know, just not as good. You did. I definitely did a little better. And what I'm, my information analysis that I'm getting from shooting this pistol is that I'm putting the dot on the red X, right? But it's going a little to the high left. So I don't know. Y'all do the math. Y'all let me know what that means for the dot. I don't feel like checking right now. Let's look at this, this grouping, man. Uh, it definitely was a little better than the dagger for sure. I threw one, but I got them all how I wanted it. Did, but that was mainly because I was taking a little bit more of my time. But they're still pretty decent pistols. If if you if you don't if you can't tell, they're still pretty decent good pistols. Decent pistols is literally about how much you train with it and how well you know you know your firearm for real for real. So. Yeah, man, my personal opinion, I prefer the PSA dagger just because you're getting way more for for your buck. $300, bro, you're getting a, MOS, well, a sight ready slide. You're getting a rail out the box that you throw a light on. You got stippling right here. You got stippling right here. And you have stippling on the front of the um, trigger guard. So they, they paid attention to the details of their firearm, which I do love versus basic Glock. Glock uh, 43X, all you getting is a plain slide, no optic cut, you getting no rail, and then you're not even getting a 415 round mag 
which this mag comes with you know the PSA micro dagger you're getting a single stack 10 round mag which I'm pretty sure nobody wants to carry because you at least have to carry like two extra mags two side cars is crazy right but other than that this is a very beautiful pistol from that boy Teak Lizzie man and I just want to let I just want to know which one y'all picking man y'all going the budget route the micro dagger which, which is over there good man for your buck or you picking this 43x spinning 580 580 for your standard standard glock without the attachments now I calculate the ta the the attachments the hollow scent and the tlr7 do the math the money you spent trying to get the optic cut in the, in the slide you could have spent getting those attachments I'm not gonna lie to you it had the same gun pretty much and it's way comfortable way more comfortable in my opinion so yeah, man. With the better trigger. Can't beat it. So let me know in the comments what you picking this micro dagger 299 or Glock 43X 580. And well, I ain't gonna say this is this is the MOS version for 580. You probably paying 550 worth like $30 less just for the same gun without an optic ready slot, optic ready slide. And no real, bro. Three hundred dollars. Optic ready with the real. Fifteen round mag versus ten round single. You let me know. Beat and comments up. Let me know. Crazy bitch, come eat the dick up, get the fuck up out of here. She like Prada, I like sex, love, keep that pussy wet. 